Hello friends, we are going to read the book Lego City Coast Guard to the Rescue. This book is written by Ace Landers and illustrated by Kenny Kernan. Good morning Lego City and thanks for tuning in today's weather report. We have got a beautiful day ahead of us, sunny with a chance of wow. So don't waste the day staying inside, it's time for some fun in the sun. No one in the Lego city ever misses the morning weather report. Everyone is ready for a bright and perfect day. A surfer dude heads out to catch some waves. Jet skiers are totally ready to race across the water. A scuba diver can't wait to explore under the sea. And we are clear, says the camera woman. Great job everyone. With the weather report over, the weatherman decides to enjoy the day too. He is going to take his brand new sailboat Sunny Side Up out for a ride. With so many people visiting the water, the Lego City Coast Guard is on patrol. The Coast Guard's job is to make sure everyone has a safe and fun day. The warm weather is so peaceful that no one is in danger. So even the Coast Guard crew has time for a little rest and relaxation. A little fishing, a little game of go fish and a little yoga make the crew healthy, steely and wise. But then there is something strange on the horizon. Grey storm clouds start rolling in fast. The waves in the water become choppy. The crew quickly jumps into action. Here comes the coast guard to the rescue. The boat navigates through the wild waters to help the jet skiers first. The crew members act fast. They use the spotlight to find the skiers. Then they throw life preservers to pull the skiers back to safety. The captain realizes that the storm is too big for one ship to handle the rescue on its own. It is time to call for reinforcement. There is a rumble in the sky. It's a Coast Guard airplane swooping in. It will hopefully save the surfer before the strong tide pulls him into the open water. Dude, am I ever so pumped to see you? Cheers the surfer. These waves are too gnarly to hang ten. Farther out, a Coast Guard helicopter spots the scuba diver. A, a rescue diver is lowered into the water on a hook to save the diver. This must be what a fish feels like, says the scuba diver. You caught me hook, line and sinker. There's still someone else who needs the Coast Guard's help. It is the weatherman. He tries to control his sailboat as it rocks back and forth in the wind. But he has bigger problems as he looks out at the ocean. Oh no, it appears to be cloudy with a 100% chance of sharks. The weatherman finds a flare and fires it into the sky. A bright burst of lights tells the coast guard exactly where he is. But the waves are getting higher and the shark is getting closer. Suddenly the shark swims alongside the sailboat. The shark pushes it carefully through the waves toward a small island. Whoa, you don't want to eat me? You want to save me? The weatherman exclaims. Once they reach the island, the weatherman leaps from the boat and waves to the shark. That was a fantastic rescue, yells the weatherman as the shark swims back into the ocean. The Coast Guard helicopter lands on the island to pick up the stranded weatherman. One of the rescuers says, We are glad you are okay, sir. But what happened to your weather prediction? Suddenly the rain clears, the water calms down and the sun starts to peek through the clouds. The weatherman shrugs and smiles. I said it would be sunny today. I just didn't say how much of the day would be sunny. Luckily for Lego City, the Coast Guard is always ready to protect and serve, even on the sunniest days. The end. I hope you enjoyed listening to the Lego Land story. If yes, then please make sure you like, share and subscribe to my channel. Bye.